Okay, we should be going live right now. Let's see. Live right now. Let's see. Okay, so we are live and um, tonight we're back with uh, Out of the Park Baseball 18, back with our No Color Barrier 1936 um, New York Giants. And um, so what I have here on the screen is, I was looking to find the player, and what I was curious is, in the last, last time I was on yesterday, we purchased um, uh, the uh, great catcher, um, what is it, Josh Gibson. And I was saying, are there any other players that we might be interested in from the Negro Leagues now that we've turned off the color barrier? And I found one Jeremy Benjamin who was a very versatile player, played look at second base, shortstop, center field, right field. Now, this is a guy I think I want. <laughs> um, not a particularly big guy, but he, he certainly made contact, had some gap power, very good base runner. If, you're, if you know, that's one thing that the um, Negro Leagues brought to the game. They had very fast, you know, stealing bases, getting those runs in like that. And um, so it's not surprising to find a very good base runner here. But he is almost a four star, five star, no, four star, three and a half star. So he is someone who is on my uh, short list to buy when I have the uh, six, I think $6,200. Anyway, so that's what I was doing, trying to see. Um, I did make a little bit of a short list. So, back to the New York Giants. Let's go back to their home screen. And hello, viewer. Um, so, we got our, um, we had our first exhibition game. Um, we're going to be playing, we, let's see, Boston, Pittsburgh, Boston, I believe, again, no, sorry, that's Brooklyn, I think, uh, St. Louis, Cincinnati, Pitt, Phillies, yeah, anyway, so let's go to our um, let's let's move along a little bit. Let's go to finish today and go to the next game. Like, um, let's go and play Pittsburgh. Uh, before we do that, let's just check what's going on. We have this trade proposal from Cleveland, and um, they would like to give us a second baseman and a minor leaguer who, mm, okay, and get Jimmy Ripple, who is decent. Now, Jimmy Ripple is much younger than Fresco Thompson, so I might want to see a bit more for that but we'll take a look at that afterwards we got um so why don't we get in into game i want to see if this is going to work i'm trying something a little different as per uh the recommendation and um i want to thank i think it was um in the discord if you follow baseball banter yeah T.J. Lowerman, for, uh, he actually spoke to the devs because I had mentioned about trying to stream these games. 
and the challenge that it does not always come up in 3D. So we'll see how this works. I tried his suggest trying his suggestion. And um, anyway, so here are our lineups. Let me see if I want to change anything. Yeah, I think I want to change our third baseman. Can I do that from here? Let's cancel that and go back to New York Giants uh, lineups and depth charts. And I want, no, this is, I want Joe Martin in, well, let's look. Why was it set to, to um, Joe Martin as a fielder? Well, that might explain it. He's not that good a fielder. Uh, if you look at Travis Jackson, a lot of potential, better fielder. So, you know what? We're going to leave it in, and we're going to start the game. And, uh... Here we go. We're going against the Pittsburgh Pirates. We got, <coughs> excuse me, Freddie Fritz, Fritz Simmons versus Red Lucas. So both right-handers and Red Lucas, almost a five-star. So let's let's see what happens here. Okay, are you getting it? Is it coming through? No, it is not. All right, let's go here and send it. That will, should fix that. Uh, you should be getting, there we go. Okay, we got the game. So we are at uh, at uh, Pittsburgh. This is still spring training. Let's go. 71 degrees. And one out. Dick Bartell. My shortstop. Two down. I need to do this face, Jen. I think it would add something here. I don't know if I can still do it. And one, two, three inning for Red Lucas of Pittsburgh. And let's see, we got Freddie Fritz Simmons. Good movement. Um, let's see what he can do. And one down. Lloyd Warner catches it. And Paul Wayner. Connor. And three up, three down again. See, they have improved the animations this year, like I said yesterday. They actually look like little guys rather than um, game pieces. But again, you're not watching this game for the graph, playing this game for the graphics. There you go. You're playing this game for the history and the realism. One out. Okay. Jojo, Jojo Moore is up. Two down. And Josh Gibson. He takes a walk. Fred Lucas is not happy about walking him. Uh, Sam Leslie. Let's see if Sam Leslie can get a hit. And he does. And Josh Gibson goes to third. Man on first and third. Two out. Jackson's up. Travis Jackson. And he gets the run in. And again, man on first and third. Uh, it's too early to take Fitzsimmons out, even for an exhibition game. So we'll let him. And we get that run. 
So now they got the heart of their own daughter, shortstop Archie Vaughn, and flies out. Uh, Brubaker, Bill Brubaker, the third baseman, is up. And he gets a base hit. We're going to move to see if we can get that double play. And that worked yesterday. And there we go. And hello, now we have two viewers. Hello, viewers. Um... Okay, Woody Jansen is up. Left fielder. Struck him out, and that ends the inning. After top of the third, we're up again with uh, Burgess Whitehead, top of the order. Flies out. Dick Bartell is up. And he gets a nice, he get that's going to be a double at least. Yep. Man on second, one out. Mel Ott. Now we have the heart of our order coming up. Let's see if we can score some more runs. And... Yeah. Gets that run in. RBI double. Lieber is up. Hank Lieber, the uh, interfielder. And another base hit. Brings in Mel Ott. So now we've gotten two runs. Man on first. Only one down. And JoJo Moore is up. And good. he hits it directly to the pitcher. Okay, two out. Man on first. Josh Gibson is up. Let's see if he can get another hit. And he does. Man on first and second. Two out. And Sam Leslie, the first baseman, is up. And that should do it. Yep. Okay, so now we got a 3 nothing lead. And we're towards the bottom of their order. Uh, Tom Patton, the catcher, is up. And... There you go. We... Oh, no. He got a base hit. Let's go back to double play depth and try to. And they they are sending the pitcher up, keeping Red Lucas in there. And Fitzsimmons catches it. Okay, one out. Now the back at the top of their order. First baseman Gus Sir. And they get the second out. Two down. Lloyd Warner, the center fielder. And he gets it. That run's going to score. Two out single. Paul Warner. Well, what? When? No, oh, it's not Warner, it's Wanner. And that looks like it's a fly out, and that ends the inning. So they get a run, and, uh,. Travis Jackson is up. Base hit. Gets on our third baseman. And we'll let the pitcher bat. Double hits into a double play. They got two out. And Burgess Whitehead. He gets a base hit. Man on first, two out, Dick Bartell. And now two men out, two men on. Melot. So. Struck him out. We got nothing that, that inning. But, uh. Let's see where we are now. Aki Vaughn, their uh, shortstop, right in the heart of their order. And pops out. Bill Brubaker, 
the third baseman struck him out and Woody Jansen the left fielder and got him that could be a tricky play so three up three down we're in the heart of our order Hank Lieber center fielder struck him out now they brought in a left-hander um Jojo Moore is up walk him so we've got uh man on first one out and Josh Gibson who has struck him out Sam Leslie so this left-hander is doing pretty well and that ends the inning so we're in the top of the fifth oh sorry bottom of the fifth and Pep Young second baseman and he's out uh, Tom Patton the catcher two down and uh, I would have let's see if they're gonna yep they're gonna let let's Berkafer Ralph Berkafer hit for himself and that's one two three inning um Travis Jackson is up and he goes now think what I might want to do is let's take a look here how tired is everybody um let's look at our position all pitchers um we've got okay we gotta give uh Let's warm up Frank Gabler. Gabler. And if we got Gabler and we've only got okay, another few innings. So let's go for our bat our batters. Um, all batters. All right. Why we want to get some contact here? Let's send up. Uh, um, <clears throat> we need a good. Let's send up Jimmy Rip, Jerry, Jimmy Ripple, and we may just put him in the game. I may keep him in the game and uh, because it's a exhibition game and he strikes out Burgess Whitehead and that's it so now well New York substitutes. Um, you know what? Wait a second. I do. Wait, let's just do this right. Um, let's see. If we put him in at, yeah, well, I'm not going to put him in, in, no. Let's try this again. There we go. Yes. And he's the pitcher. And now back to the game. Okay. So we've got the top of their order. And 
flies out. Lloyd Warner, their center fielder. Oh, that's a base hit. Okay, let's go to double play depth. And uh, let's try to get Alky. Uh, okay. Where this is not looking great. Um, we've got Alky Vaughn up. And he gets a base hit. Okay, bases are loaded for Bob Brubicker. Now, he's got to either strike him out or we need a double play. Keep him from scoring. And he's going to get none of that. This is not good. Two run single, so they take the lead. Oh no, they tie the game. One out, Woody Jensen up. Uh, we gotta go try to get that double play. And they just are hitting this guy. And fly out, he's gonna tag up and score. We got two out. All right, let's see if we can get this. Okay, but the damage is done. We're now behind by one. And uh, Frank Gab Gabler had a difficult inning. Let's see if we can get some runs. And Dick Bartell gets on to st lead things off. And... Uh, Melot. They decide not to pitch to him. And Hank Lieber. See if he can. He shoots a rocket out there, but it's, it's caught. One in. Jojo Moore is up. And he flies out. All right, it's all down to Josh Gibson. All down to Josh Gibson with two out. Man, on first and second. And I take second place. And of course, take me out to the ball game. All right. So get the pinch hitter out, Earl Brown, uh, and that is high, 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 and one Martin Dingo, he gets, so now we're behind five to three, without another pinch hitter up. We get him two down, and Otto Myers get another pinch hitter. All right. So it's our turn up. Sam Leslie, the first baseman, is up, and let's do a. Well, come on. New York substitution. All right. I am going to put in Joe Martin for Travis Jackson. And he's also going to be the third baseman while we're at it. And we're also going to uh, all pitchers. Harry 
his gumboard. It's gonna come in and finish up the game. So, back to it. Jill Martin comes up, gets a base hit. Now we're gonna pinch hit for uh, Frank Gabler. Let's do New York substitutions. Who do we want to pinch hit? Who's not already in the game? Uh, let's put him in. Yes. And let's see if he can get something, keep something going here. And. Yeah. Now back to top of our order. Whitehead. And that's it. So, this is not looking good here. Yeah. So let's put Harry Gumbart in. He's going to be our pitcher. And we're going to leave Joe Martin at third base. Um... And let's go. And we get the first. And the second out. And there we go. And this is our last shot. So, we're down by two. Got to get, see if we can get three runs. Good thing is we're getting into the heart of our lineup here. And get Dick Bartell on base. Um, with Melod up. Two out, Tank Lieber's up. I thought he walks. Jojo Moore. And that's the ball game. So, we, good game. We, uh, you know, did okay. Did not win. One thing is, I need to look at, you see, we took the lead and then this is where it did not go well. So let's leave the game and let's go back to here. There you go. Now you should be seeing it. Should be getting, this was, we were looking at uh, our third one of our third basemen here. So if you go back to our, our uh, busters and transactions, we actually can bring more into spring training. So I think that is what I'm going to do. Uh, Harry Danning. Um... Let's see. I wonder, because they started without really a spring training roster. Um, they, let's see. So let's look at this relief pitcher here. Yeah, he not not great. 
Yeah, we don't really have much of a farm system. Um, this was around the time that Branch Rickey was starting building the farm system in St. Louis. I forget exactly when he did that. Um, but, uh, what is, so we need to bring guys up to the spring training roster, I think. Um, let's see, how about him, bring him up to the spring training roster, bring Harry Danning to the spring training roster, uh, let's see what other, let's look at, where else do we need? People we want to look at here. Ali Marquardt. Uh, out of minor league options. Oh, we don't want to do that. Rule 5 draft eligible. Uh, yeah. Let's see what we got here. Now we're beginning to get some more players. Um, problem is, you don't want to lose those minor league options. So, let's save. Always want to save. <laughs> and let's look again at our lineups here. So, we got some more guys that we could, um, why am I not seeing Jimmy Ripple here? He should be, oh no, he is there, but I would say I want him here. Um, Bill Terry. Bill Terry was towards the end of his career by this time. And, uh, actually, that's interesting. He had a good year the year before. Sam Leslie, they traded for him. And I think the thought was that Bill Terry was getting older and they needed another player. So, that is interesting. And let's see something. One thing I want to see. One thing I'm trying to figure out is how do you get, how do we get cash? Okay. We got, get this revenue but I am not seeing the cash go up. And to buy more players, we need more cash. So I'm not quite sure how that is gonna work. Um, let's look at this. This is something I haven't really looked at. This is our, this is another asset. Like I say, this game is a big rabbit hole that you can just do do tons of stuff in. So this is our, looks like our depth chart prospects. Minor league affiliates, top prospects. <laughs> do we have any prospects? I'm not seeing any. Entire organization, okay. So, this is our organizational depth chart. Now, as you can see, I think what we need to do is get some prospects. Let's go back, and if you recall, um, we had 
a trade proposal from Cleveland. So let's look at this Jack Hallett. Well, he has good movement, potential, good sinker. Sinkers are good. No, so he, he may be okay. Um, so that's someone we may want to look at. Um, they want Jimmy Ripple, who really doesn't have a great, uh, he is a second baseman who's fast, good contact, good, good power. So he's not bad. But I think we want another prospect. So let's look at Cleveland's. Uh, and see who else we can ask for. Uh, Cleveland Indians. Players. Alright. Um, we want batting potential. All batters. So who do we... They're not going to give us someone great. But if we can get someone like, oh, I don't know, this 18-year-old kid, would they give it to him, us? I think we may ask for him. Now, I'm not sure. Let me go back here. Um... Discuss trade. That's what we want. Okay. So. Let's see, who did we say we wanted? We wanted, I believe it was a second base. No, it was left fielder who is a three potential. So that would be this kid. I think it was him. He was a, yeah. Hmm. Maybe another player we can use right now. Uh, like a relief pitcher. We could probably use another relief pitcher. Let's see what we got. I don't know. I think this is, I happen to like this. I don't think we can ask much more for them. They're getting, we're getting a good prospect, two prospects for a guy that you know,
and we don't have many prospects. We have a reliever we can use right now, an infielder we can use right now, and let's see. We're getting two young players and two veterans for one guy. So, assistant GM doesn't like it. So, let's have a look here. I'm not quite sure what this is. Probably thing. Our starters are strong. We need prospects. So. We can use. Maybe a first base prospect. Maybe a sh infielder prospect. Um, oh, let's see. Yeah, they're not going to give us Bob Feller. Mm-hmm. Now, oh, this is interesting. This is another prospect we made. Let's see if they would still go for that. I don't know. I mean, this guy is never going to agree to getting rid of Jimmy Whipple. I think we're getting plenty. I'm going to complete the trade. Okay. So, we need to go back to our team. New York Giants. I mean, we got a ridiculous number of players. Rosters and transactions. So, let's see. We got... Lloyd Brown. He is the relief pitcher. So, let's put him here. And Fresco Thompson goes here and now that's looking better that rust is looking better now let's look at our minor leagues we just got a couple of guys um where's our the guys we just trade traded for. Oh, you Alexander. Is that it? Let's see. They both went into okay into a double A, so that's fine. Um. That is fine. So, I think we've improved the team. Let's look at our uh, players and lineups. Graphical depth chart. Hmm. 
has more power. He's actually better than Burgess Whitehead. Um, so I'm going to have to take a look at this here because we have, um, if you look at him, he's got more power. Let's look at their fielding. So, Frisco, Thomas, yeah, Thompson, Frisco, Thompson, I kept saying Thomas, he can play second and third base, 45, not great fielder, and Burgess Whitehead, as you can see, is a 50, a little bit better fielder, not fast, but not, but good at stealing. Better contact, better gap power, because if you look at Thompson, oh, no, he has good contact. He has more home run power. I mean, they're, they're very, there's some similarities there. Um, we could probably play either of them. And if you look at all, let's go he can also play third base. So if you go back to our third base situation here, uh, we've got Travis Jackson, who is a little bit better fielder. Mm, not quite there with his hitting yet. He is a right-handed hitter. You've got Joe Martin, who is also right, who is a better, much better hitter, but not a good fielder, and isn't very versatile. Um, so that's and he would be a he would be not a bad uh, designated hitter, and but of course back. Well, this is also National League, so even today, he w we wouldn't be using the designated hitter. Um, and I want to save this trade. So, the other thing we want to do is finish today. And, and save. Let's see where our, what kind of, So we made a nice deal and we're improving the club and uh, yeah so I'm pretty happy I think with what we accomplished even though we are not um, we didn't win uh, I think we have a decent um, now, we have a little bit of, he's going to have to move up to U1. Oh, uh, if you look, let's look at our outfielders, what we got in terms of outfielders, because that, we did get rid of, lose an outfielder. We do have um, Andy Reese, Jojo Moore. We're going to need to depend on, um, yeah, Willie Duke, and one, two, two, three, four, five, and Davis, kiddo Davis. I think I'd rather, I don't know. Let's look at something. You got Joe Grace, who is a good center fielder. Uh, it's and that but he can play right as well. Um I might want Joe Grace in there. 
and then put Duke secondary. So our backup outfield is not great. Um, and uh, so we're going to have to look at that. Uh, we certainly have some good power on the bench. We still have Bill Terry. Um, let me... Frisco Thompson is definitely going to be... Uh, and English. Charlie English and Koenig. Mark Koenig. Charlie English. Charlie English is going to... Hello. We want Charlie English. And there we go. So, our depth chart's starting to look a little bit better. Um, we got Josh Gibson and Cuso catching. We got two different types of third baseman. He's a much better fielder. He is a good hitter. Sam Leslie at first, Burgess Whitehead. But we've also got Thompson, who uh, I'm going to probably want him to be in a lot of games. So we're going to have to look at that. And um, thank you, viewer. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I, you know, uh, as you can see, this can this game can get quite quite in depth. We didn't even look at strategy here. Um, nothing I want to do. And this is one of these options. I'm kind of... I kind of want to do... Get some face gen going. Uh, options. Or is, well, I'm going to have to see if I can get it to do some face gens. Uh... Um, here we go. Players in face, Jen. Um... We're now face journey. So, anyway, um, thank you for watching, and uh, I think we're going to end it here. Hope you enjoyed it, and uh, see you next time.